Hi, I'm Ancient Extraordinary, and I'm reading my Heracademia. Macademia. But I'm not gonna show the footage though, because Shoesha's gonna take it down and give me a strike. So, no. No footage. I'm just gonna have. I'm just gonna have He Man over here taking up the reins of what would normally be a chapter over here. Alright? Thank you, He Man. So, no footage. Sorry. Not, not for. No screen recording, not for my hero. Why not? I know a lot of other people are already doing it like that. So I'm just not going to show the chapter. Normally I do. But blur it. Nah, this time I can't do any. My overload cluster draws out my stress, converts it to energy, and releases it over a wide area. Redestro, can you hear me? Battle of the evil bosses. It's the pinnacle of my superpower that I've polished since childhood. But dump, but dump, his nose says. It's not an attack that can be dodged so casually. I will try to put the page numbers here though just so you know where I'm at but dump but dump says his wound in that instant he moved he suppressed his defensive instincts me that's true you miss prioritize your safety says another guy purely for the sake of destroying all right look at him we'll see him. I'm not liking this this little arc it's been Pretty cool, and I just remembered Gigant Gigantamachia, Giganto, Giganto, Gigin, Gagoon, Mr. Big Machia showed up last chapter, so you know it's gonna be crazy. All of my senses are sharpening. What? What am I trying to create? You ask. Everything is becoming clear and vivid. You guess correctly, as if it happened yesterday. Uh, that's right, his family's uh, hands got destroyed. Last chapter. I truly exist only to destroy. This, this, ri okay, I can't really show you, but you know. So page three, panel six, the middle one. This, um, it reminds me a lot of uh, the way the deck would look like uh, when he was in the all four all for one realm well, I don't know what to call it but you know that place he kind of looked like a shadowy thingy yeah that's basically what I'm talking about that's what he kind of looks like right now I don't know what they're gonna do with these guys but I feel like like I don't know I don't know what's gonna happen but it, it's gonna be interesting he's not too much of an interesting villain right now, Tomura Shigaraki. He's not too much of an interesting villain, but I feel like he's he's gonna get there. Die then, says Redestro. There is no future for a world without creation. Kind of like his design. Looks like a demon. Future? Who needs that? A world? Who needs that? Creation? Who needs that? Thank you for your kindness. Who needs that? And I'm, and I'm sorry for all the trouble he caused. I'll discipline him properly, I promise. Why is this here black? Chapter 235, Tenko Shimura Origin. Is that him? Oh, I guess his hair must have got him white because of stress. You bothered someone while playing your little hero games again, didn't you? Yes, yeah. Kotaro, stop, don't be violent with him. Mm -hmm. Interesting. If you want me to stop, then you'll listen to me for once. What's he gonna do? Because his mom was a hero and she had to put him up for adoption, or was that his father? I don't remember. Do not talk about heroes. Take Ushimura 5. Don't let him uh, inside until he apologizes. But what about dinner and his allergies are acting up right now? The rules are the rules. Haven't you been a little too harsh on him lately? He's already five, but he hasn't gotten a quirk. He needs to learn this lesson earlier or he'll only suffer later in life. Heroic aspirations lead only to misfortune because of what happened to your mama. And or grandmother. Grandmother. Yeah. Yeah, that's what it was. Yay. Cute family. Mom. Dad. Do you understand? 
My father was an entrepreneur who built a lot of wealth at a young age. He even invited his parents-in-law to live with them after building it. Now, now, no scratching. But it's itchy. Oh, that's why. Oh, okay, it's allergies. That explains it. If only we knew what kind of allergy it was. It gets itchy when I'm at home. Maybe it's not allergies. Maybe it's just a... I don't know. Hey Tenku, do you still want to become a hero? Yeah, Mikun and Tomo-chan were being left out by everyone. Tomo-chan, he says. Ask Mikun and Tomo-chan to play with me. Stop touching your eye, that's weird. Looks like you're gonna pull it out. So that's huge though. We played hero and it was really fun. And then Mikun said, Ten-chan can be all my... Oh boy. Then they let me be All Might because I played with them even though they were being left out. Why won't Dad let me be a hero? Is it because he hates me? Will he let me if I get a quirk? Of course he doesn't hate you, Dad. Dad just, he just knows. He knows how hard it is to be a hero. Kids can be. Was, dude, if I remember correctly, I don't know. I don't remember if you tried to be a hero. Kids can be surprisingly crafty, but also simple. Yes, like goblins. Goblins, did you say? What adults say is law, which is why, which is why all I wanted for, was for you guys to say one thing. But this home that my father built gently denied everything that I was. I was. Pretty good origin story. Longer chapter than usual, too. It's our little secret. I heard this lady is our grandma. Uh, okay, yeah. Okay, if she's the grandmother, alright, then those other the other two are from the mother's side, okay. And she's a hero. Hannah, why are you giving this to me? Even after what dad said, I'm on your side, Tanku. Tanko. Don't worry. That's uh, okay, page 10. He looks too, way too much like Deku. He looks way too much like Deku. It's creepy how, how similar they look. Oh boy. Let's become brother and sister heroes. We'll keep it a secret from Dad. Yuki, he says. He is adorable. Chigaraki's older sister. Or young? Yeah, older. He looks way too much. Young, young Chigaraki looks way too much like. Like, uh. Like Deku. It's creepy how similar they look. It was really human that day. My grandma was a hero. I can't believe we had a hero in the family. What are you talking about? That dog is a hero. I'm scared. What's happening? You know, Monchan. Right now, I feel like I could take on anything. This uh, did his quirk kick in. Okay, never mind. Tenko, were you in my office? I was standing. Relax. The humidity after the rain was stabbing at my irritated skin. You saw it, didn't you? And I felt a pit in my stomach. Oh boy. It's just when it happens. Sometimes you can't be too controlling of your kids if now they're just gonna, what's the word? Not like you that much. Yeah, you basically, you shouldn't be too hard on your kids, but you shouldn't be too light on your kids. You have to have a balance. Sometimes you just, you're just, you're just screw up and there's nothing you can do about it, so whatever. I, I don't know what I'm, I don't know what I'm talking about. I'm not a dad, thankfully. I'm not. I don't want to be a parent anytime, anytime soon. <laughs> no way. No thanks. Oh, he's gonna smack him across the neighborhood. Well, I only did it because Tanku Tanku said he wanted to see it. You kids can be surprisingly crafty, but also simple. Damn. He smacked the life out of him. That is not your grandma. Let's give him a second one. <laughs> 
she is a terrible woman who abandoned her own child. I'll teach you what a hero really is, my dude. You don't know the whole thing. <laughs> Help me. Hey, what the f why are what the f they're just watching? They hurt their own family. This. No, it's because you would have been killed if, if, if anybody knew of your existence, you fool. Jeez. This is the house my father built. I'm so sorry that I have to leave you like this. Kami has to go fight a really bad man. Oh, she probably died. So he does know the whole story, so this guy's just stupid then. He might try and hurt you too, Katara. That's why I need to stay away from you. Yeah, she definitely died. Um, well, I mean, that's something we already knew. I mean, but yeah. Uh, she lost against all for one. I'm so sorry you couldn't be a good mom. I know this might make you hate me. Ugh. Always love you with all my heart. So why is he like this now? If he knows the whole story, what's his deal? Is he just being strict on his kid to on Shigaraki so he doesn't go the same route? But you're going a little bit too far. Please live a happy life full of smiles from now on. And okay. And he doesn't do that. I'll always be watching you from heaven. It would have been easier if you just hated me. Kind of a dick. I've had enough. I, I went too far. Where are the kids? If you're going to hurt them, I'm done following your rules. What happened to making a happy family together? It wasn't supposed to be this way. Oh boy. This can only end badly. Muncha. Oh no. And this is when it starts. Alright. The dog's reaction, definitely. Yeah. Mm, that's not. This isn't gonna end well. And that's how his quirk manifested. So we dived into Tomura Shigaraki's backstory. His father doesn't want them to be. Doesn't want his kid to be a hero. But he knows. At first, you you think, oh, it's because he thinks his mother abandoned him. But no, then you, you realize. Then they show you, oh, yeah, they actually does know what happened. So I'm guessing he's he doesn't want his kids to be heroes so that they don't get hurt. But he's also taking it really far, which kind of cancels out any goodwill, any any good reasons why he would be doing what he does. In the end of the day, he just seems kind of like a bitter guy that just needs to relax. I get it. Your mom had to, like, let you go, but, you know, you probably wouldn't be alive had she not put you up for adoption. So I don't know what to tell you, my dude. Mm -hmm. I can kind of see how... Chig I can totally understand why Shigura what happened with Shigaraki happened. I mean, of course, it was an accident. They didn't, they didn't do it on purpose. His corpse just manifested and then boom, blah, 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 everybody died. But, you know, maybe had the father not been kind of stupid, it wouldn't have happened like that. Hell, his quirk might have ended up being something else, who knows, because it's, I feel like it might, it's not, this is just speculation on my part, but I feel like the children of people that have had all, all for one, their quirks are probably going to be... They, they might be a little bit different. I mean, we only we only know one descendant of, of one of, of uh, one of the six of one of the predecessors of the holders of one for all. But yeah, with with how they've been kind of diving into the little more intricacies of uh, of one for all. I get the feeling there's more to it, and it might have a somewhat lasting effect. I mean, if All Might could still use his power even after he was pretty much out of it, it's it's some some pieces are probably passed on to others. I mean, it's one for all after all. You gather power and whatever, but still the you gather power and you pass it on. Now you pass it on and just keep stockpiling it, but it's still also one for all. It can. It's. It's a power that branched off of all for one. So 
it might be able to be passed on to other people i don't I'm, I'm being really vague but i don't basically what i'm saying is it might be inherited some aspects of all for one one for all could probably be passed down but not in the way where all um, might did with uh deku so yeah that's basically what i'm trying to get at i just i want to see more of i just want them to dive deeper into it already <laughs> they have been but man it's there's this whole duality thing going on with Deku and Shigaraki that's that I'm starting to notice I mean I'm sure some other people have already noticed it but there's something going on with these two I don't think they're gonna be related by blood it's no but there's they have something similar about them something very very similar and now that they mentioned now that he mentioned oh i was all might while we were playing the games like oh well then shigaraki was what could have been i guess i mean honestly if the whole accident would have happened i'm sure that all might would have passed it down to shigaraki had he known of his existence it's only it's only natural his his teacher's grandson right why wouldn't you i mean it seemed like it seemed as if he would have as if his father wasn't that much too much if his father was a little bit less of a dick he pro he would have grown up to be like a kid somewhat similar to Deku really Shigaraki just needs some therapy that's that's what he needs that's what Shigaraki needs and I'm sure that his aller allergies are kind of are connected to his quirk and they have to be they have to be. That's really all I have to say about it. I'm gonna go. Which is this is H Extraordinaire. I hope I don't get a copyright strike because I'm not showing any of the visual situation. Please. Please, I am not showing any of the visuals. It's just He-Man. You can't copyright strike me for He-Man. Please. <laughs> At least not Shueisha. I'm gonna go. This is H Extraordinaire. If you liked the video, make sure to like the video. If you didn't like the video subscribe and click on the notification bell mm -hmm. prefer psychology